Welcome to our Sophistic online presentation. My name is Björn Teutrine. Hello. I'm going to show you what's new in Sophistic Reinforcement Detailing 2016 for Autodesk Revit 2016. Have you ever wanted to group single rebars, for example four bars in a column or an irregular reinforcement system in a slab to tag and put them in a schedule as one unit? From now on you are able to do so. Let's have a look at the new technology. By using Sophistic Reinforcement Detailing 2016, you can create reinforcement container, which is shown here. Depending on the layout, rebars and rebar sets of the same shape and diameter can be grouped together. Containers called Moved Rebar Set, Rebar Set, Variable Rebar Set or Polar Rebar Set will be created. If none of these layouts are detected, a general container will be placed. In order to create a container, you can use the command group. In some cases, a container is set automatically when using commands like explode, stretch trim, or move and rotate. Now I want to show you two examples. Let's start with the reinforcement of a column. Here you can see the stirrups and four single bars. You can see in the properties panel that the bars are now grouped in a new rebar set. After grouping the single rebars, you can mark them in a familiar style and don't have to manipulate or move the tags any longer. In the reinforcement schedule, the bars are counted as single bars like ungrouped bars with the same properties. In this example, I would like to show you how to group bars in an irregular floor. First, I place a reinforcement area here and remove the system. At this point, we could not tag it in a smart way. Because of that, you have to group them in the next step. Do that for both directions separately. Note that only rebars and rebar sets of the same shape and diameter can be grouped together. With the spaces, we can now start detailing. Let's begin with a rebar shape. In the table, you can find the amount, submarks, and length of each rebar. In a schedule, only two positions are listed you can find a list of rebars in the last column. Finally, you can hide and tag the rebar set. Thank you for your attention. You will find some more new tools in this new version, like the new coupler, the band fabric tool, and also the detail layer. I would say check it out in the documentation, try it out, Send us your feedback or share your experience in the user forum. Sophistic Reinforcement Detailing 2016 is available via Autodesk Exchange apps or with software service contract directly from Sophistic and selected partners. Please contact info at sophistic.com. I hope you like the forthcoming developments of Sophistic. For further improvements, watch one of our other videos called Reinforcement Detailing 2016 What's New. Thank you.